Sarah Terrell's 15-year-old daughter, Parker, loves soccer, but this fall, she won't be able to play. Losing that connection, especially in high school, especially as a kid that already feels other in so many situations is, is pretty heartbreaking. Parker is transgender, and she'll be one of the kids in New Hampshire who will be directly affected after Governor Sununu signed House Bill 1205, which requires sports from middle school on to be organized by the sex listed on a student's birth certificate. He also signed Bill 619. That will ban gender reassignment surgery for minors. Putting all these restrictions on her is not something that you would expect in a live free or die state. She's she has very little freedom at this point. Some groups like Our Bodies, Our Sports, a coalition of women's advocacy organizations which says they fight for equal opportunity in women's sports, applauded Sununu, sharing quotes from a letter that they'd sent the governor that read, women's sports are important for self-esteem, teamwork, camaraderie, and grit, but sports cannot exist without fair competition. For now, Parker's mom says she's just worried about what's ahead. Having her play on teams with high school boys that are much, much stronger and bigger uh, isn't really safe for her. So she doesn't really have any other options. She's just not allowed to play. Now, the National Education Association also shared a statement tonight criticizing the passing of this bill. They wrote in part, quote, shame on Governor Sununu for signing into law this legislation that excludes students from athletics. In the studio tonight, Ariel Metropolis, WMUR News 9.